the summer or finals again. Uh, yeah. I don't know if we're gonna have a familiar opponent. <laughs> Sounds like it. Yeah. Um, I know you don't care. You just want to wrestle whoever they put in front of you, but yeah. going out there, um, winning a tough set, some, right? Yeah. How many times did you guys wrestle this year? That is actually the first time I've ever wrestled. Ever? By that kid, yeah. In all this? Yeah, in all this. And he's Believe been in the bracket a couple of times. He's yeah. an All-American, you're a finalist. I, th I think he's the only one that I haven't wrestled yet. Believe it or not. How good does it feel to knock him off? Oh, well, it feels great. I mean, I, I definitely like, I want to wrestle everybody. I'd wrestle everybody in the bracket if I had a choice. Uh, so it feels great. In real time, we just hear it. Dalton Abney, you guys are, it's his third time meeting the NCAA Finals, correct? Yep, it is. You're the runner-up twice. What do you got to do to flip that result and make third time a charm? I love it. I mean, uh, coach told me this year, earlier when we started the year, that he was coming back. Couldn't be more excited. I want him in there. Um, I want it the tough way. Uh, so I'm just going to have to turn it on, get to my stuff. Uh, that's really all there is to it. Uh, consistency. Um, I owe a lot to my coaches and, and my teammates. Um, without them, I, I really wouldn't be where I am. So, uh, all the glory to them and also to God. Um, just really have a lot to be thankful for at the end of the day. Was Doug your grandfather? Yeah, yeah, Doug was my grandfather. So, Doug, and Doug Blueball was an interesting character. I'm sure <laughs> you could share that yeah. with people. I knew him. He used to come to our practices when I was in junior high. Yeah. What do you think he would think of your college career? Uh, I'd hope he'd be proud of me. Uh, you know, I, I wrestle for myself, but it definitely feels good having uh, him looking over my shoulder. Uh, it's kind of, a, kind of a nice gesture. Do people ask you about that a lot? Is he a, a focal point of a lot of, like, articles and, yeah. and, and stories about you? Yeah, I get a lot of questions. Um, many people know back home. And then when I come out here, especially out west towards Oklahoma area where he was from, I get a lot of questions from people that know. And, and he, is, he, is, he passed in a motorcycle accident just down to, like, in between here in Oklahoma City, right? Yeah, correct. Yeah. How long has he been gone? Uh, it's been about 12 years. 12 years. So you were yeah. a little guy. Yeah, I was little. Do you remember it? Very little. I remember him. I remember him coming to visit and uh, sitting down on the couch. And he had narcolepsy. He'd see how much I had grown. He'd pass out on the couch, and fall asleep. Um, I like barely remember that. But um, and then I obviously remember going to his his viewing and all that stuff. But. Uh, yeah, I wish I had more memories with him, but I'm glad for the ones that I did have. I remember he would do a flexed arm hang and fall asleep. Was the, am, I, am I making that out right? Do you remember? No. Did he ever do that for you? No, he never did that for me, but I've heard plenty of stories. Um, which is kind of the best part about having him as my grandpa. I just get to hear stories everywhere I go. It's like it's myth and folklore. Fun. Yeah. Right? Yeah. I love hearing it. Uh, good evening. Congratulations. Thank good you. luck for the, the, the third time against Dalton Abney in the NCAA Finals. I appreciate it very much. Thank you.